Hello and welcome to Awesome Kicks. This is the Nike Air Zoom Pixels 34. In this video, I'm gonna review it and let you decide if it's worth the money. Design wise, I really like this shoe. It has not changed all that much from before, but it has gotten a few sleeker lines and the fly wires are not as distinct as seen previously. The upper is made from fly mesh, and that's a good thing since fly mesh tends to have very good breathability and a very light weight. It's also very soft, which is excellent if you want to wear your shoes barefooted. The colorway I have here is this black one with the white swoosh logo and the white sole. It's very nice and if you look close enough you can see a very dark blue color through the ventilation holes on the upper. Nice detail. Another nice detail is a special pattern on the swoosh logo that matches the pattern on the upper. It is unfortunately not reflective. The only reflective piece is located on the back. Many new Nike running shoes have gotten a new undersole, but the one on the Pegasus has stayed the same. And I'm glad. This undersole has tons of rubber unlike the Vermeer 12, which is good for durability and grip. Plus gravel won't stick as easily into the undersole as on the Lunar Epic and the Lunar Glide. It also doesn't squeak like crazy while walking indoors like the Nike Vapor Max. This is by far my favorite undersole that Nike has to offer because of those reasons. It just works and there's nothing to complain about. Regarding the sole, there is one air zoom unit in the forefoot area and one in the heel area. That translates into a nice bounce when running off the ground and a soft but responsive landing for those who strike the ground with their heel first. If you compare it to the Vermeer 12, which also has two air zoom units, the Pegasus is more responsive while the Vermeer is more plush. I would pick the Vermeer 12 for long distance running and casual wear, while this one is better for everyday running and fast running because of the responsiveness. In short, the Pegasus 34 is a very responsive and active shoe while also having pretty good dampening. Regarding the upper, it's very soft as said before. The fit is more on the snug side which I like for running, but if I were to use this shoe for casual wear then I would prefer something looser like the Vermeer 12. Support for over pronators comes from the flowers, which in the Pegasus do a fantastic job. The firm heel cup does also aid. Even the sole which is wide under the heel and forefoot help with that matter. This shoe is therefore a great choice for mild over pronators. If you overpronate in a larger degree, then the Nike Air Zoom structure might be the better option. Okay, that was it. I can strongly recommend this shoe and I actually think that the Pegasus 34 is one of the best shoes out there for most runners. It has a perfect balance between comfort and responsiveness, plus it has a very good fit. The design is up to you to decide, but I certainly dig it. I really hope you found my review helpful, and if you did, then help me out by clicking that subscribe button and leaving a like. See you next time.